Well, the pork industry is a big part of the Chinese economy, but it has been ravaged by disease this year due to the spread of the African swine flu. The situation is so severe that the government has actually stocked up on its strategic pork reserves, even importing U.S. pork despite the trade war. But now there's a push to change the industry's business model. Eunice Yoon takes a look in the shift in strategy. Chinese agricultural companies are preparing for a greater push towards large-scale farms, similar to what you'd see in the United States. African swine fever has ravaged the industry here, wiping out an estimated quarter of China's 400 million pigs. And that sparked a call for change. China can purchase globally instead, but such a purchase will be far from enough. The buying has raised global pig prices to a relatively higher level now. To solve the problem, we have to rely on our own ability inside the Chinese system. Beijing wants to professionalize an industry made up largely of smaller backyard farms. The government is now requiring tighter controls and bigger investments in waste disposal and biosecurity. And it's offering financial support to get producers to scale up. But there are still challenges, like China's lack of experience and big farming population. For Nightly Business Report, I'm Eunice Yoon in Beijing.